Hey everybody, welcome back. We have some more MLB Perfect Inning Live footage here today. There was a big update that did occur. I'm not going to go into that right now, although just a little bit to kind of explain the rewards that I received in the inventory for this pack opening. Go ahead and check out Skull Gaming Network's channel since he did an update already, kind of outlining the event slash update. But I'm going to go here into the inventory. That is not something that was included for compensation for the maintenance. That season's best, I mean, that special edition player of the month pack. But everything else here that you see, we'll go ahead and open. Last time a pack was open, we got the potential NL Rookie of the Year. So hopefully we'll keep off on a, the same track that we left last time. Also have two boxes that are 1 million to two, 20 million GP. Hopefully something's good there. So it's going to be opening these seasons best here first. Let's see what we get. All right, here we go. We have Bud Norris by far being the best card out of these. Just because he's an Oriole starter. 67, which is one of the higher ones for... Season's best, but then again, season's best really aren't worth too much anymore since there's so much other stuff out there. So, next. I forget which one. Okay. So, this was the one that came out a while ago. I think this is a free pack. So, let's open this. It can be a 70 overall or higher. 2014 Goldschmidt. Not the right one. So, unfortunately, that was a dud. Now we have four of these most popular top 170 overall or better. Through, I think one of them was just given out for you logging in today. I think one was given for 25 days logged in. I think two might have been for 50 or 75. And if you logged in for 100 days... Or more since the game has launched. You got all three. Fortunately, I have logged in, I think, every day since it's launched. So, we'll save those for last. Let's go ahead and switch it up a little bit. We'll do one-on-one, -on -one, the stars, after every all-star pack. Hold my breath here. There's a lot of stars on the market right now. So, I'm probably going to have to hold on to it regardless. That is another dud, unfortunately. Let's go with a random box. Just going to keep on going random here, and hopefully the luck will turn around. Oof. <laughs> that was rough. Just going to do the other one right here and get these out of the way. Maybe like 10 million? That would be awesome. Nope. Okay. That was really, really low ball. So that was about as bad as those could go. Still have a lot of packs, though. So let's go with the 2013 pack. I still have rewards for the All-Star event, which I've been meaning to get to. All right, Alex Gordon. An AD overall is pretty good for that. That was the 50,000 points from the All-Star event that I spent on that. I still do have a good amount of points. I don't know if I want to use them for complete ticket supplements or to get another pack. Um, so I'm going to wait on that, but that's not a bad one right there. Could be, could be a lot worse. And I have to clear my inventory, so I'm going to go ahead and clear it. All right, I'm back now. That won't be a problem again. Sorry about that. But let's go ahead and jump into that Stars draft. Michael Conforto. I honestly didn't even know that he was a star. That was one of them that I kind of overlooked altogether. I'm sure the market's flooded with him. Nine million. Again. Nothing too phenomenal there, so I'm going to be saving this all-star pack that cost 100,000 points from the event. I'm going to save that for last. We have four chances here. I wish it was kind of broken down, but it is what it is. All of these are going to flash at the same time. Let's see what we get. All right, Chris Sales, $125 million. That's not bad. Kenley Jansen, that's an 84 overall as well, so he's a B cutter. 
I don't think I'm actually going to be going into the market right now and checking out. I know that pretty much all of them are flooded since everyone has gotten these packs today. So I'm assuming none of them will be able to be sold right away. But let's check out that sale card. I mean, C-rated all around. His stuff is 98, which is really disgusting. And Kenley Jansen. The command's a little low on the card, but his stuff and his break is really, really good. So you could really just focus on raising his command. Pretty good. And I almost forgot there that we have the 83 overall or better here. So let's end up the pack opening on a strong note. Xander Bogarts. Okay, I'm... You really don't have any comment on that one. Not what I was hoping for an 83 or overall the better. But, you know, I feel like this could have went worse. So kind of middle ground. I'm not too happy, not too sad about it. Just kind of even keel there. So there'll be more packs in the future and hopefully something amazing comes out. I'm still all right since Bellinger was pulled in the last video. So I feel like that was some pretty good luck. So it's kind of evens out in the end. But that's going to be it for now. Thank you for everyone who was watching this video. I will see you in the next one.